missile compact launcher for the H3 module. Firstly, you want to go into the arsenal, select your launcher, which will be the 10 MPRL compact launcher, um, and then we're going to go into the backpack to make sure we have room for the missiles. Um, I'll show you twice. Let's just get to our platform. Now you pull out the compact launcher from your back, reload it. This can be fired upon uh, vehicles, uh, buildings as well. Uh, so what you want to do is aim towards a vehicle of some sort, so maybe the tank. You want to zoom in with the plus sign or plus button on the number pad to the right of the keyboard. When you've done that, you want to then change to thermal by pressing N for November. Either one, doesn't really matter. And once you've done that, now you can press and hold, keep hold of tab. And that is tab, top left. And once it makes that horrible noise, that's when you can fire. Best thing to do is make sure you're wearing plugs. And two, make sure you tell any surrounding allies nearby, uh, teammates, to uh, watch out for the backsplash, because it can cause damage. So we're going to fire now. I'm just going to show you how you can change the feature from top to direct as well. If we go on to configure, go on to controls, and then go on configure add-ons, um, too far, you go to ace 3 weapons, and in cycle fire mode, all you do is go into that, press any key, I'm going to press this, and it doesn't really matter what you want to do. Press OK, continue, and when I go back to this mode, and there's the same tank again, all I'm going to press is the key I designated to change direction. As you can see, it's top to direct, top, direct. So the good thing is you can still lock on when it's direct. It just changes the position when you're going to fire. Firing. I hope that helped uh, for this quick tutorial for the ACE-3 uh, MPRL compact launcher. Keep up to date with the following tutorials coming up soon. Thank you.